Mitch is on the line next from Fontana, California. Hi, Mitch. Hey, Leo. How's it going? I'm doing great. I have a question for you. Hopefully you can help me out. Okay. okay. Um, I've, I've been using Windows Media Center on my Windows PCs for years as a DVR. You're the one. You're the one using it. That's great. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm the one Microsoft guy. Microsoft says left. nobody uses it, you know. That's why they killed it. I liked it because it was unlike other DVR capturing software because it integrated directly with the remote guide, so didn't have to manually set times and, uh, you and know what? channels record just select the program. You don't have to talk me into it. It was awesome, and I'm furious with Microsoft. Yeah, and that's that's my problem. When I upgraded to Windows 10, it's no longer there. They delete uh, it. You know what? I'm guessing that they probably did that because the Xbox One has that capability now. I think that's the thinking, but it's it's terrible. So here's the deal. They said they stopped developing it in 2009. There's no, There hasn't been any, any changes, but that's fine. It worked, right? Uh, right? They also said, according to our telemetry, very few people used it. And most of the people who opened it closed it immediately and never opened it again. <laughs> Yeah. But there are yeah, a few. I with like an add-on. I agree, I, I, I and that's what they did with Windows 8. Remember, you had to download it, but you could. Yeah. Um, but the, but they don't they don't like it because they didn't put any money into it for six years, and they really I think I think there's more to it than meets the eye. It's not that people didn't use it. My suspicion is it has something to do with copy protection. Mm, you could be right about that. Now, here's my question. I've I've moved to uh, Plex for my everyday excellent, media center needs. Excellent choice. I, I love it because yep. I love it especially it integrates directly with my Chromecast. Works so on everything. Works on Apple TV, server, Roku. TV. Yeah. And I love that, but I'm still really missing the DVR capability. So I mean, Plex can't really do that for me. So I'm looking for an alternative. So there's a couple. You get your uh, TV over cable, right? Uh-huh. Yeah. Because um, if it's over the air, there's there's some good choices. Uh the people in the chat room, and I haven't tried it, keep telling me HD Home Run. I think they talked about it yesterday with the, when Scott Wilkinson was filling in. HD Home Run. But does it work with cable? Can you get a... Uh, yes, it does support cable cards. So what you'd have to do is go to your cable company, go to the store the, in, the, in town, the cable company store, and say, hey, I need a cable card. And what they do is they say, I don't want my set-top box anymore. I'm going to do my own set-top box. You may be doing this already because you have a Windows Media Center. Have you been doing it that way? Oh, uh, well, I, I was, but I've switched providers since okay. that happened. So you got to get a cable card from the new provider, and you'll put it in this thing called the uh, – it's from Silicon Dust. And it's it's designed to give you back the HDR capability, but you but it's just, all it really does is interfaces to your cable and gets it on the network. Then it's up to you to record and all of that. Okay. And there are good choices out there, like Myth TV, which is a Linux distribution. Um, well, actually, I, I dual boot myself with OpenSUSE. Okay, so you know what you're doing. Mm -hmm. um, so, so to my knowledge, this is the best choice for people who want to continue to do it. It's kind of a roll your own solution. Nothing is as easy. Oh wait a minute, they do have their own D DVR software. That's good. So they're really pushing. In fact, here's the front page on July 29th. We said goodbye. To Windows Media Center, find out how to use HDR, HD Home Run DVR to replace it. So I guess they they they're really trying to replace it. Yeah, it's from SiliconDust.com. Not right, expensive. It's out. just basically what it is is you need the hardware to take the encrypted cable signal, decrypt it, and then you put it out in the network and use their software on a PC because it's not a PC. It's not a DVR really. It's just a box. Right. Okay, I'll have to check All that right. out.